coach was talking about to some of the options they got at the punt return game. How, how confident do you feel? Is that something you want to use to make an impact on this team this time? Well, I feel very confident about a uh, punt return game. A lot of just come down to just owning the ball and just seeing what gap over and just hit it. Man. But other than that, I feel very confident in punt return. Kick return, wasn't that more of your kind of background in Bloomington? Or is there a different skill set between returning the punt and returning the kickoff? Uh, it's kind of a different skill set between like returning punts and just like ball more in the air. Over, but, uh, I did both uh, kick out return and punt return when I was in there. How crazy are those kicks from Master Mono? Are you Man. used to it yet? What's that yeah. guy doing? I'm kind of used to it now. Like, he's just coming with owning the ball. Like, I'm feeling very confident. Uh, but Master Mono, man, he got a, a leg on him. That hang time be sitting up there and that ball just be rolling all over the place. Chris Marvell mentioned with the offense that he'll talk to the quarterbacks and see what they like and what they what works well for, for this, this group of players. Has he talked to, to the receivers get input too? Has the running backs get input and plays you like and, and parts of the scheme you guys like? Um, yeah, we get some. Like they talk to us about the scheme and stuff and all that. But uh, I feel like the quarterbacks, like, this really. Time, I feel like they put the ball in the right place. Like DJ, man, he got a great arm. Rob, he got a great arm. Or, or other than that, I like what's going on. Does it feel uh, how much, how far have you guys come from spring to, to now preseason game? Uh, now to like preseason camp, um, I feel like we're doing well. It's coming all together. Like, we're just gelling, man. Like, I feel like everything clicking now. Do you know what your role is going to be, whether it's been more in the run game or the pass game, or are you just happy to do, you know, whatever coach you're uh, uh, I feel like my role is just being a playmaker. Uh, I'm excited to whatever, just opportunity, uh, just taking advantage, advantage of it, really. And then what's it been like, you know, throughout spring now to fall, playing with Ja'Kai every day? Has that been kind of what you match with me when you talk to us, you know, back in December? Uh, yeah, uh, just playing my brother, man. I'm just very excited to just be a part of this. And uh, just think that my brother just take me in do you ask the coaches like what your GPS numbers are, what your speed is? Is that something you you care about or know about? Uh, I just go out there and play. I really don't care about the GPS numbers. You see the speed on the field. Are you the fastest? Yeah. <laughs> have you looked into Georgia Tech at all yet? And if you have, kind of what stands out on Philadelphia? Uh, yeah, I looked into Georgia Tech, but they're a great team. Uh, they got a big guy on the front. Uh, they got some good DBs, uh, but. I feel like it's just going to come down to execution, just looking at the signals and just going to get assigned to really uh, just outworking them. That's what it's going to be about. Anything else? Jalen, um, do you feel like back in Indiana you had, what, three returning touchdowns that year? Do you feel like that's kind of the bar that you wanted to set for yourself when it was all that you feel like you can top that? Uh, I feel like I'm going to top that. Uh, my standard is just be better each and every day, uh, just come out with a working mindset. but. Uh, I'll just lock in on special teams. Like, that's a big thing to my game. That's it.